Ooh, welcome back to Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. My name is Crow, and today we're gonna actually fight some impossible levels created by you. I went into the workshop and I typed in the word Crow, and I found so many very, very cool levels from you guys, including this one. Impossible for Crow 4. Impossible for Crow. Impossible for Crow. Um, it seems like you guys like to pick on Larry. Crow, not even you can beat this. That's probably Larry right there. Why do you guys hate Larry so much? Why don't you get you be nice to him? You have to kill Larry? Are you kidding me? Here we are on the first impossible even for Crow. And oh my god, Larry! <laughs> what have you gotten yourself into? <laughs> there's ninjas and dragons and there's monks and there's everything everywhere. Larry, how am I supposed to keep you alive? How am I supposed to prevent you from instantaneous death? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's try and figure this out, guys. All right, let's get this. My first instinct is to simply cast spells and to delete everyone with god powers. But as you can see, some ranged attacks might have already occurred, including some of this fire from these dragons. What I could do is I could maybe blow everybody away and then work from there. Oh, Larry, we might have an idea. So we have the fan spear blow effect. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna start going in a circle. You can't really tell right now, but I'm using the all button and I'm going in a circle around Larry. And I'm gonna try and blow everyone away if possible. I'm gonna go up here and blow all these guys away. I'm hopefully going to affect people. There's a watcha! There's all sorts of stuff here. And we're just gonna try and blow all these guys away and maybe that'll help keep Larry alive. We're gonna find out the hard way. Okay, all right, I think I've done a pretty good job. Hopefully we can keep Larry alive in three, two, one, go. Maximum slow-mo, there's the wind. Faster slow-mo. I've pushed away a lot of people, but not enough. Larry's right there. He's being tickled by the fire. I think he'll survive that. Now we have to deal damage. If you think any of these little ranged units are going to survive and be able to deal damage to Larry, you're mistaken. I will protect Larry. He's our boy, okay? I am his god, and as his god, it is my responsibility to make sure that Larry is okay, that Larry does not get harmed, that Larry thrives, survives, and becomes a, a, a wonderful, constructive member of society or something like that. I don't know. Let's start with that. All right, here we go. Ballista bullets going out. Let's see how well that goes. Boom. I killed a bunch of units. Now we have a whole bunch of monks up here. Let's deal with these guys right now, shall we? Just get these guys done with the ballista bolts and go. Well, bam. Good night. Larry's still alive. Larry's still alive. Look at him go. Let's take stock of our situation. You look good. You look great. You're praying into the sky going, God, I need some help. And, and don't worry. God's right here. God's got you, fam. God's got you. Um, God says, what's up? Who's left alive? Who's coming to challenge little Larry? Is it you? Well, we're just gonna make sure you die. Oh, there's a couple monks just chilling around this corner. Yeah, no, you guys are done. I just launched that monk through that wall. <laughs> hey, there's some monks here. Let's get them done. Let's keep a nice close eye on Larry, who seems to be walking this way. There's ninjas here. No, you're not throwing ninja stars. Apparently, Zeus's lightning is now my weapon of choice. <laughs> chain lightning. <laughs> Gotta be very careful with the lightning, though, because it does have the ability to chain into Larry. We do not want Larry to get smacked by the lightning, guys. That just be terrible. Oh, oh, there seems to be a ninja right there. Make sure he dies, guys. The ninjas are actually one of more free of. Larry's chilling there. All right. The ninjas are the ones that kind of scare me because the ninjas have ranged. And I'm really afraid of the ranged. Oh, oh, there's a monk over there and a dragon over there. Making sure he's done. And someone's wiggling right here in the wall. Oh, it's the dude I launched into the wall. I think I killed him now. I think he's done. Larry. Oh, there's a monk or two up there. Hey, is that monk dead? I think I killed that monk. Oh, they're alive. Hi, monks. <laughs> is anyone alive? Oh, there's a monk up. No, no, there was a ninja in the wall. There was a ninja in the wall. I call shenanigans. This one's called impossible for crow too hard. 
and the only unit I can summon are skeleton warriors. I can summon <laughs> two skeleton warriors, and that's all I get. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Look at this. This is so unfair. How am I ever supposed to beat this without using god powers? All right, all right. We're just gonna paint a happy little picture of blunderbuss balls because you can't use the same god powers. Now there is, I have an idea. I want to destroy units by sending them into the sky and not killing them. So I'm thinking in one of these battles, I'm gonna take the damage of ballista bolts down to zero and I'm just gonna send people up in the sky or, or balloon arrows, I'll put balloon arrows down to zero and then I'll send people into the sky. I think that's gonna be a fantastic idea and I'm just gonna keep painting with these blender buzz balls and then go boom. Oh, oh, it's impossible. Oh, Crow, you could not possibly defeat this. It is impossible. These poor skeleton knights have all these swords coming towards them. This one's called Impossible for Crow to... What is happening? Guys, what have you designed? What have you built? What is going on? What even is this? How is this even fair? How is this even fair? It's just so many units. It's never ending. Where's my unit? Where's my unit? I can't even start the fight, guys. Guys, you can't you can't build these impossible fights if you don't give me a unit. I have one point. I I, I can't. Is Larry? Did they? Larry cost 340 points. I can't summon. Guys, I can't beat this level if you don't give me a unit. Oh, it would have been so much fun if you just put Larry right here. This would have been insane to try and pull off. But I can't. Are you joking right now? Is this a joke? Oh, and mammoths. And mammoths, because why not? Let's just add mammoths. Some clobbers. We'll throw some clobbers in there. And then we'll throw some defenders in there, because why not? And just sprinkle them in there. Just mammoths. And are you kidding me? See, now you've given me Larry. You've given me someone to protect. So we have to hit start and then pause immediately. This is a joke. If you don't have God powers, guys, don't even bother. If you don't have God powers, don't even attempt this. Larry is surrounded and we must defend him. So what is our strategy to defend Larry from this? Okay, so we have these ranged units right in front and they're actually the scariest part. These need to be dealt with immediately. We need to get them off their game immediately. So what I need is point blank damage. I need to make sure that they have zero time to throw absolutely no time to throw. If they throw one spear, even maybe even more than that, they throw just a handful of spears, Larry is a goner. He's done for. So we're going to send out these Melissa bolts in every direction. Now, they're not going to reach the chieftains in times. So I might need to do another row of ballista bolts just to make sure the chieftains get knocked off their game because these guys summon the spikes and if the spikes hit Larry, he's dead as well. So this is like a deep multi-layered attack and if I fail, if I fail even one time on one unit, I messed up. Now, same with these spirit throws in the back, we're gonna deal with them and then once this is taken care of, once the first layer of range attackers are done, guys, we can take a look at all the melee units and maybe have a little bit more fun. But right now, this is fight or flight. This is, we, we just have to. Three <laughs> rows of ballista bolts to deal with the ranged characters in the front. Let's go and take a look at Larry. Let's get in there on Larry. Just kind of, excuse me, coming through, excuse me. All right, Larry, I like your hat. It's a beautiful little hat you got going on there. Let's see if you survive this in three, two, one, go. Pause. No, no, there's spears coming, no! <laughs> I think. No, they're not coming. They're falling. We actually killed them before they had a chance. And look, look at all the stabs of all the chieftains. <laughs> we killed them before they even had a chance to throw anything, guys. Larry's safe. Larry is safe. He is sound. And now we can just destroy everything else at our leisure. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> Probably shouldn't be doing this, <laughs> but I want to. I want. I want to do something kind of stupid. I want. I want to do something just a little bit. Eh, maybe a bad idea. 
This is gonna be one big explosion. Ring of death. Here we go. Pause. Yes. <laughs> Nothing will destroy Larry. Nothing will kill Larry because we will protect him. Just explosions in every direction. Oh, oh, there's a little dude that somehow made it through. Wow. That's a cool shot. Look at him. Just braving the explosions, trying to get in. That is such a cool shot. Let's just make sure he doesn't get close, shall we? Like that. Perfect. Where are we at? What's happening so far with units? Oh, Larry seems to be in good shape. He's now looking into the distance at the next row of units. These explosions are making it difficult for me to see. There we go. Now we can see what's going on. Oh, the mammoths, guys. The mammoths are coming in. Okay, let's go with some um, candle fire. Let's throw some candle fire at these guys here. Can they affect chieftains? Oh, baby, they can affect chieftains. Oh, mammoths. A little bit close. Hey, 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 guys. We know the one thing that will definitely send a mammoth flying. Literally, just completely send the mammoths flying. I'm so mean. Goodbye, mammoths. <laughs> you know, I could pretty much beat everything with the, uh, the ballista power. It's just so good. It's just so unfair. And it's so wonderful. But I want to like change it up and use different well, these mammoths are close. I want to use different powers because they're fun. But I love the ballista power. It's so effective. Um, now if you'll excuse me, I'm going to send out ballistas in every direction in three, two, one, go! <sighs> now, guys, these balloon arrows, they deal zero damage right now. Zero damage. So what's happening is I'm just basically launching these things into space. <laughs> Get in the sky. Give me more balloons. More balloons. More balloons. Wow. These units do not want to fly, guys. They refuse to fly. Even with zero damage. They're not flying. At all. At all. All right. Time to end this. Let's get out of this level. Firework arrows. Firework arrows. Like that. <laughs> get lost. Get out of here, Mr. Mammoth. Who's left alive? Oh, there's some balloon arrow guys over here. How about some firework arrows? There we go. We did it. We saved. Oh, I got... I, I can't I can't believe we did that. That was just nuts. That was just insane. Larry! Do you uh do you have any faith in your god now?